In a country torn apart by racism, the game of rugby was a symbol of violent division. Yet one man saw it might become the path for peace when all roads seemed to lead to civil war. Nelson Mandela spent 27 years in jail because he fought to liberate his country. Mandela was going to be released, and there was a lot of fear from white South Africans thinking, what's going to happen to us? Angry was the mood of his black compatriots, even after his release. If the leadership could just let us loose, whether we are going to lose our lives or not, we were definitely going to do something. It could have plunged this country in the gravest racist war in the world's history. But Mandela understood that there could be no democracy without peace, no liberation without reconciliation. In rugby, he saw an unlikely opportunity. Rugby gripped a nation, a fever almost. I could see the faces in the crowd. I've never ever in my life seen or played in a game like that. This is our World Cup, this is our country. I don't think I've ever seen so many flags. That game gave people a taste of what can be in this country. This is Lamu. His family's way down the middle. It was not something to be enjoyed. It was something to be endured. The players would have played until they dropped dead. They would have run through any brick wall. I think they understood that their lives would change forever.